guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be quite a different haul, and this is going to be a pineapple haul. I know it might seem strange, but I did do a haul, I believe a Target haul, and that was maybe about a month ago, maybe a little bit over a month, and I said, hey, do you guys want a pineapple haul? And then I mentioned again, and I was like, hey, I'm gonna do it, you guys want it. Now I'm finally doing it. Today is going to be a pineapple haul. I know that might be a little bit strange. If you are someone who's not a fan of, I don't know, pineapples, I don't know if you have something against pineapples, this video might not be for you. But I love pineapples and everybody knows I love pineapples, so thank you so much to everybody who's been tagging me on Instagram. So the main things I've been seeing on the tags are is the guy when he's getting his hair done like in a pineapple type of do. Uh, the other one is the Ferrero Rocher where people are decorating a wine bottle, putting the green leaves and making it look like a pineapple. Uh, what else? What else? Oh, the stand tall, wear a crown, be sweet on the inside phrase. I don't know. I forgot how it goes, but and that I actually ordered a shirt with that phrase and it never came, but it said it shipped. So I need to check into that because I need to contact Etsy. Anyhow, if you're not a fan of pineapples, then this video is probably not for you. Uh, just wait out for my next video, which will be Friday, because I am keeping a filming schedule, like I told you guys, of Wednesday, Friday, Sunday. Uh, just because I just want to keep it in that schedule so you guys know when my videos upload and you guys can check those days So let's start off with what I'm wearing. Okay, so this one is from forever 21 I believe this shirt was like I don't know nine bucks 995 something like that I know it wasn't over $12. That's for sure um, Some of them are colored some of them are black and white. So I just thought this was really really cute. So Here's my pineapple shirt I got from Forever 21. There are some things on certain sites that when you type in pineapple, because that's what I legit do. I go, I, I go, I go on different websites and I'll type in pineapple. Some shirts and some bottoms are like over a hundred dollars. I'm like, skirt, what? I don't know. I just happened to notice that a lot of things are super expensive with pineapples, but. Your girl got this shirt for less than 10 bucks. I believe it's like $9.95, something like that. I'll link it down below though. Next up, which is one of my favorite items out of all my collection of pineapple stuff. And the stuff that I'm gonna be showing you is a lot of decor stuff or things that you can use. So this guy right here, like, isn't he so adorable? I got this from Bath and Body Works and he, she has like little heart sunglasses. And I think this is supposed to be like a pineapple nose, but to me it's like, Loops. And let me show you what the point of this thing is. It's not just to sit on your desk because it is supposed to be on your desk. Boo! It holds a hand sanitizer. So this is the one that I have on my desk right now. I do happen to have the pineapple sanitizer from Bath and Body Works, but currently I just have the energy one because I just need some energy. Sometimes I don't need the energy, trust me, but I don't know. I just really love the smell and it kind of like, like relaxes me. So I don't know what this was, but all I want to do is zoom, 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 and zoom, zoom. I don't even know that song. That's like the only part of that song that I know. <laughs> what? See how happy pineapples make me? I don't know. It's just something about pineapples just so cute. And I don't know why I got this obsession out of nowhere. It literally came out of nowhere. Uh, I have no clue. Pineapples are just so cute. Maybe because I'm part Hawaiian too. Who knows? Probably has nothing to do with it, but I love pineapples. But yeah, it just sits on your desk right here and I just think it's so cute. And I think it was like $5.99, something like that. Also, Bath and Body Works does have a pocket back holder for like your purse or on the go. Has a little keychain which you can just latch onto your purse, which I really like. And this one is the Pineapple Luau hand sanitizer. And on the back it has like little rhinestones. I don't know if you guys can see that. Rhinestones right there. Everybody was tagging me on this or sending me a picture or anything on Instagram. And at first, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't like it. I was kind of like, mm, that doesn't really look like a pineapple. Like, like it's not pineapple-y enough for me. And it's this right here, and this is a Starbucks tumbler to keep your drinks nice and cool. Uh, tell me why I just found out that if you use any of their cups, like for hot or cold drinks, that you actually get, what is it, like five? or 10 cents off your order. I mean, after a while that could really add up because I know a ton of us go to Starbucks. I mean, it might not seem like a lot, but I had no idea. And plus you'll get good use out of your cups. I mean, I've been using this cup a ton, but I feel like other cups that I've bought, I haven't really used them on my own house, but I feel like now that I know that you can use them in Starbucks, that I'll get more use out of them because I kind of like collected them because they look so cute on the outside, but it's like, let's get real. You have to use them. But I got this tumbler. This is what tossed me off is that there's only like one little pineapple shape right there. I hope right here, here it is right there. And I'm just like, hmm, I wish there was like a bunch of, like more, more than just one. I mean, is there more than just one? I believe it's only one. Yeah, it's only that one. So I don't know, it kind of tossed me off. I wish there were like a couple within the cup. 
But then my girl Emily, she was like, hey, look at this. I just got it, thought of you. And I was like, if she has it, I have to get it. Emily's actually a viewer of mine and then I met her and her mom, Jen, at Generation Beauty. And then after they were like, hey, we go to the same nail salon, blah, blah, blah. And then we went and we went to the nail salon together. So yeah, so we became friends. And yeah, so she text messaged me and she's like, girl, you need this. And I was like, okay, I'm getting it. But I really like it because I use this almost every single morning for my ice water and I stick some lemon in it and it keeps it nice and chill. And I just, I really like it. I just think this is keeping me on track to drink more water because I'm getting more into the habit of drinking more water because I notice I don't drink enough. Shh. Sweaty Betty, uh, I am. It's very hot in my room right now. But moving on to the haul, I got these placemats from Target and they were on clearance when I got them for only $1.99, which I thought was a steal. And I love placemats like this, especially for me and Glenn because I don't know, but random fact, but he always makes fun of me. I always make a mess whenever I eat, no matter what. When when we're out to eat or even we're eating at home, like once I pick up my plate or a waiter or waitress picks up my plate, I'm like, <gasps> it's like a buffet underneath my plate. So I really like this because you can just wash these and scrub them down and really clean them with sponges. So I really like this, only $1.99. Oh, I got the matching kitchen towel. I got the matching kitchen towel and I only got one. I don't know why I only got one because I think it was like at the end of my trip of Target and I was just like, I gotta get out of here. What's wrong with me? One item I wanna mention is I have the Bath and Body Works Golden Pineapple Luau. I don't like this scent. Honestly, I'm kind of sad. I bought two of them and I had 20% off and I do not like this scent. I don't know what it is. It's like, like I like it, but I don't. It smells kind of funny, like the after smell. Uh, I'm not a fan of this one. Let me know if you guys have tried this one, but I'm not a fan of that one, but I like the hand sanitizer. Next up, I have a silver kind of decor piece. This one is a silver pineapple. It's not too heavy. It's actually pr pretty light. I got this at Lamps Plus when they had a sale and I got it for 20% off, which I was really happy of. And I saw it online. So I'll link, I'll link all the things down below so you guys can find them if I can find them. So yeah, I got this at Lamps Plus and I was just like, is that a pineapple? So now I'm gonna go through like my pieces that are behind me. Now this is my favorite, favorite piece out of all my pineapples. I love this one because I love like the creamy bottom and then like the golden top. It's my favorite. I wish I can get another one. I got it at Home Goods for only $14.99 and you know how Home Goods goes. You find it. If you want it now, you better get it because if you go back, it's gonna be gone. Me and my mom have actually hid stuff at Home Goods. One time there was this vase that she really wanted and then she happened to hide it and we came back and then some lady was holding it for probably about 10 minutes debating, putting it down, lifting it up, going around the corner, I was gonna go grab it and she came back and I was like, oh my gosh. So my mom's like, just watch her. So when she went around the other corner, she's like, go! And I grabbed it and she came back and I was like, oh! and we put it in our car and my mom got it. We're bad. <laughs> That's how it goes in home goods though. Like my mom is constantly hiding things. She's like, oh, it's gone. <laughs> and honestly, 90% of the time, even if you do that, it's gonna be gone. But this is one of my favorite pieces and I wish I can get another. So next thing I got was this golden pineapple that actually comes apart. And I picked this up at Nordstrom. I forgot what they were advertising this, I guess like as a holder for something, but I got it and I took a risk because on the reviews, a lot of them were saying like, oh, it's not like the right color that they show online or mine came damaged. Mine did kind of come damaged like within the rim over here, but not like a substantial like, oh, I want to return it, but I just thought it was cute. I don't know. I, I don't store anything in here. I don't know what I should put in here either. And then one time at Target, I was going through the card section, which I had no party, no birthday, no nothing to even, I don't know, I had no business being in that aisle. And I did mention this in my Target haul though. And I found this golden pineapple. Now this one is not just one that comes apart and there's nothing to it. It's actually a candle and it smells so good, but I don't want to burn it. I don't know. Maybe one day I might, but it's citrusy. Um, there was like a little crack on here, but you can't even tell. It's like right here. And it's one of those things where it's like so reflective that you can't even tell. So I just turn it around and it is 100% again. But I really love this and tons of people were actually tagging, on, tagging me on this too because I think Target posted this for their Instagram or it was on someone's Instagram and tons of people were tagging me on it, but yes, I do have this. And of course, Bath and Body Works always comes through and they had a pineapple little candle holder. And of course, this is the golden pineapple candle. 
I do like the candle. I don't know what it is about this soap specifically, maybe because it's like the foaming one and not like the regular one. I don't know, this one smells so much better, but I really like, oh, how much was this? This was $9.50, but I did have 20% off, and then this candle, I never get the candles for $22.50. I think that's a ridiculous amount. I always wait till they're on sale, and I always wait till I get that 20% off. If you ever use that app, Retail Me Not, it's a lifesaver. You can use it while you're in the store. Just click on coupons inside store and I always, there's always something. Next up, I got a brand new phone case and this is from the brand Sonics and it's this case right here. And I have a gold iPhone and they also have this phone case but in peachy tones, but I didn't want the peachy tones because I felt like they were kind of just gonna get washed out with my golden phone. So I really like this. I think it's super cute. It also has like the bumper on the inside because it said something like, uh, don't sacrifice style for protection or something like that, but it's really sturdy. I've dropped my phone I don't want to crack it. I do have one of those protective screens though So I will say that but it is a sturdy phone case It's not super cheapy and it feels really good on my phone where it's not gonna crack or anything like that But I thought this was so cute and this is from Sonics and I got a Nordstrom next up I have this cute little jewelry dish that I found from Target and I found it in the clearance section uh, this one was originally, it doesn't say, it just says trinket dish porcelain with no price, but I know it wasn't more than $5, I don't believe. The little rose gold pineapple reminds me of that one, but that one's obviously golden. And then my last two items are actually items that were sent from very sweet, 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 sweet subscribers. This one I got sent was this cute little cutting board. Look how adorable is this. I have vlogs coming very soon. I have been off my vlogging game. Apologies, I have so many to put up, but I do have an unboxing where a super sweet subscriber sent me a package a couple weeks ago, and one of the items in here was this cutting board, and I love it. I use it to cut up my uh, my onions, my, my lemons every time in the morning to put in my cup right here. So I have like pineapple galore. Oh, they also sent me a pineapple necklace that's upstairs in my room. And then I got this random package the other day, and I was thinking, your girl didn't order anything from Sephora, but Candy Herrera, oh my god. I got this case and I was like, oh, maybe it's like PR or something like that. So I have this case, you open it up, pineapples. I thought that this was so sweet, so I wanted to definitely do a shout out on here. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. This is so cool because look at the top. This is for brush, uh, oh. Getting too excited. This is a brush holder, so you can stick your brushes in there and then protect the bristles right here. And then you can put all of your makeup. And then right here, it also opens up in the center, which I just think is genius. There's also little slots right here to stick things in. This is the cutest case ever, and I'm definitely going to be using this for my next trip, wherever I go, so I can store my makeup in here. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. That was like the sweetest surprise ever. So if you guys are interested, she got it on Sephora. And I just, wow, thank you. I swear, I remember when I opened like both the packages up, like I did vlog the one, but this one I didn't vlog because I wasn't vlogging that day, but I knew I was gonna mention it in this video. I was like, what? But that is it for my pineapple haul. Let me know if you guys are all pineappled out. I told myself no more pineapple things because honestly, I don't need any more. I've had like my pineapple fix. Uh, I just get my fix through eating pineapple and I also have pineapple gummies in my cupboard as well but I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Sorry it took so long because I know a lot of you are pineapple lovers as well Forgot one last thing. I have the Erin Condren little pineapple cover thing that you can just buy and these are the replaceable ones and that was my last item and that is it i hope you guys enjoy don't forget to subscribe to my channel because it is free 99 and i will see you guys in my next video all my social media will link down below and my next video will be friday friday whoop, whoop, and then the next one sunday so i remember i planned on filming on wednesday or not filming uploading wednesday friday and sunday so always look out for those days wednesday Friday, I swear I'm not doing gang signs, and Sunday. So that's when I'm gonna be uploading my videos. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in my next video. Mwah! Woo